You worked at Apple before, so now yeah. you're at Google, although Nest, you've said, is, is still separate. Are you seeing, you know, what is, what is the difference in the culture between Apple and Google? Google is 15 years old or, or so. Uh, Apple is much more on the uh, 30 to 35 years now. And so the cultures were created at very, very different times in history. We didn't have networks uh, at Apple when the Apple was created and the culture was created. Didn't have mobile phones, didn't have any of that stuff. So it was a much more hierarchical structure and the communication structure was very, very um, understood. At Google, it was born out of a network culture. Everyone could just talk to everyone and they could learn about everything and there's much more transparency. So just having those two different cultures, I'm not saying one's better than the other, but it's very different that with the very first day when the deal was announced, I got all of these various individuals um, from inside Google saying, oh, congratulations, and I want to work with you, and is there something we can help you with? And, and, and at Apple, it was very structured, like, you're not going to just send us a, a message to Steve for any reason and just say congratulations and flood his email box. It was very, very different. And I, I embraced both. In this article, Larry Page admitted that Google's mission statement seemed a little bit outdated. The, the mission statement was to organize the world's information and make it universally accessible and useful. So. He said he was kind of in search of a new mission statement. It's, you know, to be determined. Since you're at Google, if you had to think of a new mission statement, what would you think the mission statement now would wow. be? Wow. <laughs> wow, that's... Th really? <laughs> you're going to put me on the spot with that one? Hey! Um, well, let me think. Uh, Really, I think it's going to, I would think it would be, a, uh, it would, you know, it's the, the original mission statement was, it was very broad and it was very much about information. I think this is going to be about, uh, the next mission statement is going to really be about societal impact around the world, a positive societal impact to accelerate change, to bring and to get rid of many of the problems that we have today with lack of transparency in government, lack of transparency in how we consume energy and our natural resources. I think you're going to see much more focus around that and removing drudgery and those kinds of things that are a part of our everyday to make more effective knowledge workers. 